windy, raining, and Carol has sent me out to get some video while she sits in the wall by the stove working on another video. Anyway, I'm off to the antique center and then into the shopping mall. So you walk down this little side street, the canal is there, just beyond it is the bus station. Well, it's good to get out of that miserable weather and into the antique center. It's 10,000 square feet. They got 45 dealers with pictures here. And 1995, it opened as an antique center. So I'm going to give you a bit of a whistle stop tour um, for anyone who's interested in antiques. It's one of those places you really have to come here, you have to poke around. And that's the same as saying you can find all kinds of things you didn't know you needed. Somebody who's into Toby jugs, that kind of stuff here. And looking at the prices also, they're very reasonable. This is a whistling copper kettle, so it's a little bit more expensive. <whistles> if I remember right, these are 48 pounds or something. Nice copper kettles, coal scuttles, the fire irons down here but there's there's sets of fire irons everywhere there's the screens even a, a wonderful old fire front here now it is a conventional fire that is a nice looking stove that is gorgeous how much is that 375 superb salameki stove reduced to 375 go downstairs first then we'll work our way up. Cairo. Good furniture here. Again, not, it's not really gonna work on the narrow boat, but some of the, the um, storage units, a nice, it's a nice corner storage unit here for 75 pounds in pine. That's pretty. George Best book. It's just one of those places where you actually never know what you're going to find. I can see that working well on, on a boat, on the rope wall. That's a pretty picture. 15 quid. Print on board. That's, that's a snip. Oh wow, look at this. Retro Big Ben alarm clock working isn't that gorgeous I love that and it's purple very tempted by that and it's a proper wind-up as well it turns out the clock runs very fast we've lost three days since he bought it at our age time is passing fast enough oh well Tempest Fugit yeah you have to come in you have to just come and look around this place Of these kind of knick-knack areas. Look at all these hooks and ironware. Elephants and mermaids. That do somebody on their boat. You obviously attach this one with the nail through the navel. Ouch. Perfect. I've got nice shelf brackets. There's a green teddy. Look at that. tools, got plumbing, bolt cutters, lots of mirrors, all these planes, smoothing planes, and chisels, oh, massive, the size of that, that's, that's huge, boomerang, that's ideal for dogs who won't play fetch. Snap-on tools poster. It's very subtle and unusual. Pot. It's almost like a coffee pot, isn't it? It is copper Turkish coffee pot. Twenty-eight pounds. That's a good price as well. Do 
do you remember when having a soda siphon at home was the ultimate in sophistication? You can make your own sodas. There's another tilling up. It's in good shape as well. 26 pounds. And you can still get the mantles for these. So 1920s Cameo conch shell lamp, 65 pounds. If I bought this, I'd just be being shellfish. What beautiful thermometer with mercury in it as well. They've got several barometers. You're under no pressure to buy. 1960s light up cocktail bar, Umberto Mascagni, 350. That's very cool. Staffordshire pottery figures, Staffordshire figures, and there's more up there on the wall at the back. Some more steps into the, it's probably like a mezzanine this it's a patriotic ukulele I could play that when I'm cleaning windows but so much interesting stuff to look at magic round right about boing time for bed look at that he's severed it in his box I don't even remember that they made that for Corgi, but they obviously did. Nice travel alarm clocks. This one, my favourite. Designers, Clarice Cliff, 1930s, 32, 34. Blue Chintz, 32, 33. Capri, 1935. Crocus. Doesn't have the year for that. The Rodanthe pattern on the jug is 1934. We've got some more craft here. There's some lovely pieces. So there's something for the kind of the quirky, but there's also stuff here for collectors. Look at that bowl. I love the 1930s stuff. It's a nice restored dancette with, with a monarch turntable. My sister had a dancette and that was where I first heard Beatles records. Record player serviced, cat tested, 2021 fantastic sound, 225. Well, we've even got uh, some cool old mil military stuff in this section. Yeah. Flying helmet and goggles, 95 pounds. That'd be ideal on the back of the boat on a rainy day. So we come up now to the top floor. So you, here you've got some vintage clothing. This is Carol's favorite. Food, Marmite. She loves Marmite. If you ever don't know what to get Carol as a gift, just buy her a big tub of Marmite. And there's a Star Wars X Wing Fighter. It's a good size. Stands about two feet, two feet high, that one. Boat dogs. It doesn't say how many CCs this guitar is. Maybe it's a 250. And a pounds.
I like this tray. Repent at leisure. Marriage is a gamble. It starts when you sink in his arms and ends with your arms in the sink. Many a wife has turned an old rake into a lawnmower. Marriage is all give and take. You give, she takes. Marriage is a great institution, but not everyone wants to live in an institution. Boys will be boys, and so will a lot of middle-aged men. Man has a wolf at the door. From the day his wife puts a fox around her neck. I like this bottom one. Husbands are all alike, but they have faces so that you can tell them apart. Yeah, something for everyone. There you go. You can do Tommy Cooper impersonations. <laughs> Just like that. Tinned Westy. And then back down. <laughs> so what have you just bought? Converse. These? Like these. Is it you got two of them, didn't you? Yeah, Match, two. matching pair, two foot. left feet. Yeah. yeah, yeah. All right, so, and this is where I got my Adidas the other yeah, day. it's very good deals in here. Can I video you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, nice so, yeah, nice bunch of people. So, come in here, and the prices are really good, actually. Absolutely. They've got crag hopper trousers, lots they've got warm clothes, lots of warm clothing for the winter, lots of waterproofs, fantastic selection of Adidas and Converse as well. You even got this rare red pair. So hey, come hey. and buy them. <laughs> this is it, and it's right by the car park in the centre of Skipton. So they are a friendly bunch, aren't they? They are, very. Not pushy. Not at all, very helpful. Yeah, good place to come and buy your sports shoes and clothing. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, please like, comment, and share. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe and click the bell to be notified when we put up new content. See you soon.